Welcome back to the Power Public YouTube channel. Today we're going to show you how to service your Bendix or starter reduction gear on the Vortex Mini Rock. So let's get to it. For this job you pretty much only need a 5mm Allen key. Undo these three screws here. And then you need to undo, undo these four screws on the back of the Bendix cover. So then it's just a matter of just tapping the, engine, uh, the starter motor just gently until the whole assembly comes off the back of the engine okay there's a couple of dowel pins here there and there and that locates this assembly on the back of the engine and also stops it from falling off when the bolts come out so you will have to give it a little bit of a jiggle to get those moving off the dowel pins so then all you got to do to clean all this up is remove those two screws and you can pull the Bendix straight out. Now you can see here, this one's pretty clean. These normally get really gummed up with the chain lube that flies off and bits of rock and dirt. And what can happen is, this is the starter reduction gear. So when the starter motor turns here, the Bendix or the starter reduction gear spins and comes out. And then this is what engages in the ring gear to turn the engine over. And what happens is when you get a lot of dirt and chain lube and stuff here, it's too much resistance for the starter motor and you'll press the button and this will spin but this will not throw all the way out and that's what can cause uh, some wear on the back of your ring gear as well. So grab some workshop solvent or brake cleaner, something to break down the chain loop and just give it a bit of a once over there with a rag like so. Okay all the parts are moving here. So then when you're finished We'll get some spray lube and just spray some lube on there so everything moves nice. Also too, you can clean inside of here and also into here. This fills up with a bit of stuff, just a bit of solvent there. And um, yeah, just give it a good old once over. That'll clean all that up schmick. So get some uh, lube and just spray that on there, okay, and work it in. So you could use some spray grease in here or some just some light, light grease and just give those a little bit of a lube up. Okay, and then that just goes back in there. And this guy, he bolts on there, which is just a reversal of the procedure from before. These have got a little bit of chain lube on them, so give them a birthday. Screw those in there. Do okay, so now that is all back together and clean, ready to go. Sometimes these Bendix, there's a little o-ring here that breaks um, and the, the counterweights are flying around in there. These sometimes fail, they just don't work. The, the teeth get damaged in your starter motor. So if that happens, it's just time to change, get the new part, pull it apart, change, put the new part in and then put it all back together. So get the assembly and line the two dowel pins up. Now it won't just fall on, you've got to give it a little bit of a jiggle to get the two pins to line up. If they're really stiff, you can tap it lightly with a, with a soft hammer. And we'll put these guys back in here.
And then you've got to put these three screws back in. Now two are long and one is short. The short one goes in the middle and the two long ones go on either end. Alright, so that's how you service or replace your starter reduction gear, sometimes called the Bendix, on the Vortex Mini Rock engine. If you've got any questions, leave it in the comment section below, or check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Power Republic. Also, you could go to our website, www.powerrepublic.com.au, and maybe get yourself a hat or a t-shirt, I don't know, just saying, if you want to like the videos and you want to show a bit of support our way, you go check that out. Until next time, see you in the next video.